What's going on YouTube? Back with another quick video today. Um, this video is about my 2013 F-150 5.0 Coyote motor. As you can see in the description, it is about the exhaust that is on it. This exhaust has been on the truck for exactly 12 months now. When I was shopping for this exhaust, it was really hard to find any videos of broken in exhausts, um, especially the Corsa um, or any Corsa exhaust videos in particular. So this is the DB Performance Exhaust by Corsa um, off Summit Racing. <clears throat> The only difference between the DB Performance by Corsa and Corsa is the grade of or quality of steel they use for longevity purposes of rusting or, um, you know, oxidation. I don't know. So, to me, it's underneath the truck. I'm not going to see it. Um, it sounds the same. So, I went with the uh, more economical um, exhaust kit. So, a couple things to note. I do have a cold air intake on it. It's a stage 2 AEM. Um, fresh tune up on it. Uh, spark plugs. Um, the truck is running on E85 right now. I don't have the programmer uh, tune on the truck right now. It's in stock mode. Um, so again, the RPM range isn't going to be super, super high. This is going to be basically if you were to take your factory, you know, truck and throw an exhaust, this is the sound you're going to get. With the tuner on, you can rev it out a little bit more. It gets a little bit more aggressive uh, tone and a little bit raspier on the high end. But for this video, it's going to be stock. Um, so again, cold air intake on the front, um, the resignator has been deleted, it's not the delete kit, I had a pipe welded in from a local exhaust shop, um, and then it goes back into the DB Performance um, by Corsa muffler, and then um, you'll also notice I have a black tip on there, my truck is uh, black everywhere, so the uh, kit came with a 4 inch chrome slash cut exhaust tip, so I got rid of that, um, and I had this 5 inch tip laying around in the garage, so I went ahead and got that put on there. Uh, to go with the black theme. So we're gonna get jump right into it and uh, do a cold start off and a few revs, uh, wake up the neighbors and we'll do that. So, so uh, here is the truck. I'm not gonna show you the uh, intake or anything, but um, you can see underneath, I'm trying to walk and lay under here. <clears throat> so starting from the top of the engine, you can see that's where the resignator was removed. I have that pipe welded in right up there. And then as you move back, here is the DB Performance muffler. This is what it looks like 12 years later, 12 months later. Um, so it's not not in bad shape, not the prettiest thing either. I can see it looks like I do have a little bit of a moisture leak coming out of that gap right here. And as you move your way back, there's the piping that comes with it. And as I mentioned, there's the uh, five inch tip. So I think it's uh, like two and a half or three inches into a five inch outlet. So that's what we've got for the exhaust. Um, go ahead and do a cold startup right now. You can see what it sounds like. basically with a cold start up. So I'll do a quick walk around. 